For those of you that paint on paper, whether you're using watercolor or acrylics, you know one of the absolute worst things is when you finish your painting and it dries, beautiful, but it's covered in wrinkles. So I'm gonna show you how to take that crinkly, beautiful artwork that you have on paper, iron it out and get it frame ready for your customers. Let's dive in. Okay, so let's get started. First, you wanna make sure you have a really hard surface to work on. Go on ahead and turn your iron on and make sure it's warming up and getting nice and hot. A simple sheet will work for this. I personally like to use a pillowcase. It gives the painting protection on both sides. And you wanna make sure that you take your painting and slide it into your pillowcase or under your sheet face down, okay? Once your iron indicates that it's warm and hot enough, let's get ironing. We wanna move the iron back and forth in various different directions and you wanna move relatively quickly. You don't wanna stay in one spot for too long because that could potentially damage your art and or burn it entirely. And that's not really what we're going for. We're just trying to flatten this piece and get all of the wrinkles out so that we can get this ready to frame. It'll be nice and flat and sit very well in the frame for your customer. Okay. Set your iron aside and while this is hot, be sure to grab some books or something heavy to place over your painting. Now we wait. If you don't want to wait for your painting to cool, that's no problem. You can just leave these to sit overnight or as long as you need to leave the painting and come back to it. Okay, so it's been a few minutes. Let's go on ahead and remove this. You can take your painting out. And just like that, you've flattened your paper piece. So you can take this piece and attach it into a frame and ship it off to a customer. All right, I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions, please be sure to drop me a comment. And otherwise, happy painting.